Hello to everyone in the world. Well, as you probably know, these PLS bulbs adapters have a um well <laughs> a starter inside here, so you don't need like an external starter. You just need to well a ballast for on this and it will start by itself. The little starter that these bulbs um, come with is uh, enclosed in this little box right here in the bottom. So, um, I have this one, and this is my old, you can, I, I think you can remember my beautiful um, BNL um, H5A 3 by um, well, three PLS bulbs, okay? So, um, this bulb is another made by Philips. This is from 2015, so it's actually newer than these ones that are made in um, 2012, as you can see the 2H there. So, uh, the starter here is failing. Uh, so, let me, I, I have opened it already this this is the starter that it's in inside the, the base so let's plug this thing in be careful with this old plug that is a little uh, old and well as you can hear the ballast is, is humming and the bulb is the, the electrodes are glowing so it's actually you have continu continuity on the on the electrodes but the starter won't come on I don't know why so if you let me, I'm gonna uh, try to repair a PL bulb. So you, this, we can call this a guide to repel to repair a PL bulb. I don't recommend it. If if your bulb is not longer um, good, I I suggest to go and let me unplug this. So not not to uh, burn uh, too long the the electrodes or the ballast. But anyway. If if you um, have experienced the same problem, I suggest to go and buy a new one. But anyway, let's see what we can do. Okay, what have we have here? So I replaced the original starter with a, a condenser with a external one that what that is intended sorry for um 14 to 20 watts now this is a 13 watt bulb so for one watt i don't think it will um, matter much but well yeah I, i'm going to <laughs> rewire that this is not uh, final i just want to prove if, if the bulb will turn on but i want to see if uh, this bulb will run again and the problem is the starter not the bulb itself so let's let's see okay so i have now wired up the new uh, starter and yeah using those um little wires that come in the bread <laughs> so this is not safe at all i really don't recommend doing this but i do it so you don't have to okay so let's see if this thing works out in three two one well <laughs> nothing is absolutely nothing is happening i think it's something loose here let me take a look yeah i don't know why but this thing doesn't work <laughs> so let's try something different okay so what i'm going to be doing next is uh, i'm going to swap up the starter in this 13 watt uh, Ditzman uh, lamp into my um, Philips bulb that this original starter doesn't work. So as you can see, here is the edge of the bulb. It was made in, I think, in uh, H is for August 2015, right? So let's see what happens. It didn't work like this one. <laughs> so let's try it again. in there 
is actually a little bit more worn than the original one so i th i'm i think i also gonna prove if the if the only thing that is wrong is the is the condenser not the starter itself but anyway let's see if this thing works this is a moment of this is the moment of truth <laughs> and here we go oh my god as you can see yeah the bulb still works the problem is the starter or the condenser i don't know this is the original condenser it seems like a trident uh, chewing gum i don't know if in the us you have trident uh, chewing gums but anyway <laughs> oh my god so the bulb still works so i did i don't know why it, it didn't work with the 14 watts one uh, if you know please let me know but as you can see it worked well with the 13 watt one so I think for now I go, I'm going to, I think I'm going to sacrifice this uh, Tishman uh, or this man, I don't know how to pronounce that correctly, uh, bulb as I prefer a Philips one made in, well, China, but it's a Philips one, <laughs> than a Tishman made in also China, but I mean, this is Tishman, who knows Tishman, I prefer the Philips bulb because also it matches with the other one so sorry so i think i'm going to do another runs to see if the problem is the starter or the or the condenser and well let's put it back all together inside there i have the the new the original starter as you can see the the tishman is a little bit more, more worn so it will be nice if if the original still works and the problem was the condenser so let's see well, there you go. <laughs> I think you have the answer right now. But let's let's well just see that the the star is was still glowing. There, there you go, there you go. So probably there is something funny there. Anyway, let's try it once again. Well, for now it seems to work. So I think I'm going to the, to let the 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 original starter, and well, let's see what happens. So I have now um, um, <clears throat> joined the condenser with the original with the original starter of the Philips bulb. Now I have to wire up correctly and put it in the original place, and then. And uh, fix this mess with the aluminum. <laughs> so, and also I'm going to be, uh, this was just for the thumbnail. Also, I'm going to be wired up this Dishman bulb with the other condenser to see if it works. So, let me wire up everything. So, I have now closed the um, the base on both bulbs i try to be as um, harmless to the aluminum as possible but well <laughs> it didn't turn out very well in the philips one it was easier on the tishman as well i think it's what it was more manageable but yeah philips bulbs this is a fresh one this is an unopened one and an opened one and yeah it, it, it's it's tighter in a Philips one, but anyway, they now now work really well. So now that it's all ready to go, let's prove them. And uh, this is the one that I just repaired. I said I put here that I um, well uh, upgraded in the in the 18th of July. But I think I'm going to be uploading this video uh, two weeks later than today. There you go. And just for fun, let's prove that if the Tishman still works. That I don't think so, but let's see. Yeah. <laughs> As you can see, the problem is the condenser. The Tishman didn't work. This is another Philips that I just have lying around. Yeah. Mm, the Dishman doesn't work. Let's 
put another one in and there we go here we have our three oh yeah our three fluorescent PL bulbs with one repair it well I really don't recommend repairing a, t a PL bulb yourself as actually they also didn't they don't uh, sell the the spare parts well, if you are really into electronics, you probably will know what kind of condenser they used. But anyway, I I really just suggest to go and buy a new one. But for myself, I have now my other Philips working now. 